athletic director. <laughs> that was actually the SID back then, but uh, thank you. Um, I want to start off by congratulating everybody who's being inducted today. Um, it was great working with all of you to see the pictures, the media guides, um, all these things they bring back a lot of memories. And it was a lot of fun riding around on buses with you guys and the vans and going to the World Series, the basketball tournament in Oklahoma. Um, as a guy that didn't play sports, you treated me like I was part of the team. So that was, that was a lot of fun. So thank you. Um, a few years ago, Christmas time, members of the Pioneer baseball team got together and um, it was a lot like a lot 12 years ago when these guys were all together. There was a lot of reminiscing, talks about uh, trips to Florida, the World Series, stories of home runs that beat bigger name schools that these guys weren't supposed to beat. But in 1998, Mike hit 400 with 11 home runs and 69 RBI, and that's still the second most RBI in a single season of Point Park history. He was part of a group that we often refer to as the Canadian Pipeline, um, a collection of some of the best young players in Canada who found their way to this college in downtown Pittsburgh and made it to the promised land of the 1998 World Series in Oklahoma. Uh, Mike's numbers, they speak for themselves. A 377 career batting average, tied for the single season record with 13 home runs in 1999, and a point park career best, 216 hits. But here's what we need to know about Mike. What mattered to him most and his teammates was winning. Uh, an individual career day was not as important as the end result on the scoreboard for the team that day. In a sport that's fixated on numbers, there was no numerical value to measure Mike's love for the game, drive to win, and passion for success. So I'll give you great pleasure today to introduce MD Mike Smith.